All right, and we're back. This should be the last part of uh, floor four. It's not a very long floor. It's just tedious, I think, is the better word. So there's only two more of these honeycomb patterns we got to go through. So if you're getting sick of this dungeon by now, don't worry, it's almost over. Thank God. Um, but once we're done with the dungeon, we're going to start dungeon five. And then we're going to go do the cleanup, which shouldn't take too long. And then, uh, yeah, we'll be done with the game. It'll be probably only two more videos. So I hope you're uh, ready to cry at the end of this uh, Kingsfield adventure. Pick up the damn herb. There we go. Why not? So we're almost out of herb, but we're going to get a lot more in a few minutes, trust me. Not a big deal, though, because we're going to switch over to Antidote. Or not Antidote, but, um... Big Boy thing. I don't remember what they're called. I swear to God there's an illusory wall in this area, but it doesn't matter. There's nothing in here that I actually need. Well, that's behind an illusory wall. Hmm. Actually, have I learned it yet? Damn it! I haven't learned it yet, and it's really bugging me. I just want to get the best spell in the game. Is that really such a tall order to ask for? I mean, this nuclear bomb is pretty good, but, like, it could be better. Just saying. Okay, and I don't remember what the fuck is this. Phantom Rod. Oh, fuck you, dude. So, if you were, like, in the beginning, like, Oh, man, so that's going to run out of fucking magic every five minutes. This sucks. This game has bad magic and item placement. Not really. <laughs> if anything, it's a little busted that we can get this much magic. Because it really doesn't become a problem after a while. All right, so we want the right-hand side. That's fine. That's easy to remember. I do not remember... Oh, that's a Verdite. It, when in doubt, those boxes that are magician locked are probably just verdite. And I don't really think I remember. Is this the shortcut? I think this is the shortcut, I'm pretty sure. This is the shortcut! <laughs> so there's an area in this dungeon called the Earth Shrine. That's technically what we're trying to get to, but we also need to kill the Dark Magician. Yeah, because, you know, it's been overused for too many years in Yu-Gi-Oh, so now it's time to go. But hey, if you played Kingsfield 2, uh, the American version of 1, you'll probably go, Hey, wait a minute, wasn't that the guy that was, like, mentioned in the lore in the first game in America? Yeah. And look, we got stone hands. I got amber herd hands. That's amazing. But no. This. This is necessity. All right. If you're like, whoa, what's that fucking thing over there? Oh, don't worry about it. It's not a big deal or anything. It's only like a essential item for the game. Don't worry about it. What are you worried about? You're not even playing the game. You're just watching. It's the Dragon Sword. Also called Dragonstone Sword in some versions. Looks a little bit like the uh, Moonlight Great Sword, don't it? Well, it's not finished. God damn it. Let me pick up these herbs. Okay. So, this is the grave that Skibbity Riz guy was talking about. Uh, or Darmok, as I'm just going to start calling him. Um, this is, like, the most items in one room in the entire game. And it's very obvious you're supposed to pick these up to indicate where you're at. Gimme! So, the passive effect of the dragon sword is it just regens your magic, but we aren't doing that. So its attack is way too slow. It doesn't have a magic yet. Um, Cause it's not the moonlight great sword just yet. Um, but it, it, if spoiler alert, the moonlight great sword is the best weapon in the game <laughs> has the fastest attack, the highest damage magic. It's just the best fucking thing in the game. The dragon sword on its own, it's kind of doo-doo, okay? I'm not going to try and sing high praises for something that doesn't deserve it, all right? This is, this. I was raised to assume that everyone got, like, a gold star for trying. That hardly ever happened, by the way, as a millennial. 
But, uh, that, that sword doesn't get one of those little fucking I tried bonus things. No, it doesn't get it. It's shit garbage. I mean, it doesn't even have magic. It's just glass in a tang. It's really not really that good. <laughs> Obviously. Fucking idiot person made it. Me? You bet. Will you die already? Thank you. Fuck. All right. Theoretically, I don't even need to kill enemies at this point in the game because we have enough items, but no. <laughs> Why would I do that? They they can drop things I still need. But um, no, that's actually the very last weapon in the game we're going to be using uh, in floor five once we get the uh, sword repaired. Uh, what else? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Whoosh. Okay. The magic attack on that also is extremely dangerous in a good way. Uh, it fucks up pretty much everything. Uh, I don't... I think it does holy damage, but, like, the actual base damage of the weapon is, like, in the 20s. It's goddamn ridiculous. So. Okay. Oh, well, thanks, guys. I really didn't need you to be there. But I appreciate the uh, the warm welcome wagon you guys have rolled out for me. Thanks, though. I got I got stuff to do. Appreciate the effort. So once you get the Dragonstone Sword, that's the only important part of this dungeon you need to worry about. Now we can go and finish the fucking game, basically. The I wasn't kidding, though, either. This next boss coming up can kill me in one hit. It's no joke, okay? If I'm not careful, I can die in a second. And if I die to him, I'm going to be very upset. <laughs> but I've prepared, okay? I'm ready for this. Count me in, coach. I'm ready. All right. So I do know for a fact where a Verdite's at. I keep saying that, but it's true. I do know where one's at. And if you're like, oh, do you really? Yes, I actually know where one's at. I'm not pulling your leg, okay? I ain't playing no games. No dents, no dings, no damage. I am just waiting for that message to show up. I really am. Because once it shows up, I'm going to get like a stiffy. Okay, it's that intense. When it shows up, you'll know exactly why. Okay, that's just depressing. Oh, come on. They really just said, alright, let's make this the most inconvenient dungeon for anybody ever by just putting the most annoying enemies in it that just take a ton of damage. Oh, they fell on top of each other. That was cute. This game's so progressive. Okay. Damn it. I just wish the AoE was bigger. I really do. But that's just... That's just whining. It really is. I'm really trying to practice with that fucking attack, because I'm not kidding. I want to make the final boss look like a bitch. Well, it is a bitch, because it can kill you in one second. It's also program... Excuse me. It's also programmed incorrectly. And these guys have lingering hitboxes. I haven't mentioned that till just now. Um, it's not programmed very well. Well, I had to fix it in the actual coding. But it does um, so much damage that it can kill you within a second. This is Verdite. Want to know how I know that? It's there. Those little holes are a little spooky, can you tell? Did I learn it yet? Damn it! <laughs> I just want it! Can you tell I love it? It's a good spell. It's the best spell in the fucking game. It's better than, like, the Moonlight Greatsword spell. It's just insanely good. Damn it. I just want it. Can you tell I just want it? But nah, we're almost at the end here. I don't think that there's a... Like a dungeon split like these things? Yeah, there is. I'm a liar. I'm dumb. Doesn't matter, because they're all pretty short. So... But we'll... We'll talk about it when we get there. You'll know exactly when you're going to go into the either the final boss or the final secondary dungeon. Because it looks very distinctive. Which is actually a good thing. Um... Because one thing about the Kingsfield games that they do correctly is they actually do know how to make you look like you're in a different area. 
because there's like a landmark or an enemy or a music change. Later games in the series have music changes, uh, usually dictate where you're at, which is great because you actually can tell a lot faster just with that. If you're listening to the music, why would you not listen to the music in this game? It's fucking slapping. See, I even let the music play so you could hear it. It slaps so hard. It really does. It slaps. Who thinks their arms are long enough to slap box? Slap box. Let me show you, maintain this shit ain't that hard. That hard. Man, that song's so impressive. It's almost like, you know, he's just the best lyricist ever. Lyricist. It's almost like he had probably a shitload of practice when he went in the studio and recorded that and didn't do that all in one go. And it was probably spliced together from like four or five different things for the studio version. It's almost like music is a little, unfortunately, not as magical when you know how to make music. But, no, nah, that's still a great song. It was so fucking overplayed, and it was because... Ah, uh, let me show you how to do it, I'm a superhuman! Like, that fucking long moment where he's... You make elevated music, I make elevated music! Like, it's like, cool, he spoke fast, and then it ruined the entirety of rap, because everyone just started trying to do the same fucking thing. I didn't think I'd be talking about Eminem at the end of this game, but I somehow am. Don't ask me, because I don't fucking know. So there's only two little parts left. Second to last boss in this area, and the Earth Shrine, I think is what it's called. Earth Temple or Earth Shrine. Give me those things, baby. Those are good loot. I didn't know they dropped those that frequently. <gasps> I don't care about gold. God damn it! I just want that spell. <sighs> I'm getting blue balled over it. I really am. Can you blame me though? It's fucking. I'm not gonna spoil it. When we get it, you'll understand why I'm so excited. Because if you've watched my Kingsfield 2 playthrough, I guess Kingsfield 1 America, you'll go, oh, understandable. Seth isn't just a complete idiot that gets excited over nothing. Okay. Now I think this is. I want to say this is the path to the Dark Magician, and I'm pretty sure it loops. The Dark Magician's true form is a hideous monster. No, he's not. He's Yugi's favorite card. Don't be racist. All right. Now, I want to say this also loops. So we come in through there, and then this loops on top of that area. Oh no, this doesn't loop. This is actually the, the Earth Temple, which I don't mind doing first, honestly. Okay. I love how they drop Antidote, but nothing even drops the ability to poison you anymore. It's kind of sad, really. Actually, no, I think there's an enemy that can poison you in the very final dungeon, but I, I'm going to fucking blitz through that shit like the speedrunner that I am. And you're going to go, wow, that was very underwhelming. And I'll say, yeah. Kingsfield games have terrible final dungeons. They all do. They are all just universally ass and extremely frustrating and challenging. For different reasons. I think that's the worst part. Now, double checking before I fuck it. This is just, uh... I'm away, Calvarion. Yeah, that's the Verdite. Okay, cool. That takes care of all the little dungeon paths. We have all the XP, all the items we need. Well... Minus one. A very special item. Okay, in terms of spells. It's only something that appeals to me because I like how broken it is. <laughs> Can you blame me, though? Can you really? I'm impressed by stupid things. I'm not ashamed to admit it. Okay. So let's see if I remember the partitions here. Because they're all in the same location. And it's a little bit messy. But it's also very poorly telegraphed, too. And you'll see why exactly when I get there. We'll do the Earth Shrine first. Oh, there's two boys. Oh, hell. Hot damn. Double kill! You see... Magic is fucking cool. Okay? He thought it was dumb? You're dumb. None of these are illusory walls. I'm 99% certain of this. This is just a dead end, right? No! One of these is an illusory wall. Seth's an idiot. Don't listen to him at all. Dunked! With the gun! 
You might be like, now, Seth, how can you top this fucking nuclear fireball? How can you really top that? Trust me. If you know, you know. You're in the know. So that's the boss, I'm pretty sure. Which I also think probably has the translation wrong here. Just says it's a hideous monster again because it's being racist. Okay, so this is important. Let's hit the save spot because this is the most important part of the entire game. I'm not exaggerating. Okay. I gotta get my bearings straight here. Alright, this is... You ready for bullshit? You think that door's locked? They look like all the other doors that have been locked that have been like that. But it isn't. Okay, so you gotta fucking constantly move in here, because, uh-oh. New enemy. Golden golems. Mmm. The golden grams. I'm partial to those honey nut clusters. I don't like that commercial. If you know what I'm talking about, it's like a cowboy, and he's like, I'm partial to those honey nut clusters. I want to say it's a... Oh, who fucking cares? You don't know what I'm talking about, neither do I. Alright, so these guys only spawn once. They cast stone, which... If you're a true Kingsfield fan, you know is the coolest spell in the game. Alright. These guys look so goofy. They look like GoBots or something, like, from Yu-Gi-Oh. They don't look intimidating at all. I do not want to stand still. They can kill each other pretty easy on accident, which is amazing. They also drop Fire Mail, if you haven't got it by now. Why you wouldn't have it at this point in the game is beyond me, though. Get out of my house! Okay. They do a lot of damage, if you couldn't tell. Uh, but look how much gold they drop. <laughs> it's almost like this is the part in the game where they said, fuck it, these enemies should just drop randomly huge amounts of gold. I think one of them is actually conditioned to only drop one. I might be wrong, but I'm never wrong, so don't listen to me. Okay. Blammo! Nice ass crack, nerd. There we go. So they got dunked. Good. So what do you think this is? The Magician's Key! Straight from Kingsfield, America. It's pretty tits, ain't it? So this is the most useful key in the game. It unlocks everything. Like... Every item in the game it unlocks it, I think. Don't quote me on that. But it unlocks everything. So we're going to use the Magician's Key, and we're going to store some shit. So we don't need the Key of the Dead, Dungeon Key, Light Family Key. We need the Harp still for a little bit. And we don't need Antidote. This will actually store them if you pick them up in your inventory. And yeah, that'll work. So, look at that. This look familiar? It's because this is the fucking area that we didn't go to. God damn it. Oh. I'm like, why won't it go? That's why. So that's an idiot. I think that just says all my men are dead. And it's basically all your bases are belong to us. So if you screw up and you go down this path, remember when I was like, there's an area that I said don't go down it unless you know what you're doing? This is why. I think that just says all my men are dead. Yep, all my men are dead. All my bases are belong to us. Okay. And this is absolutely, the game is basically broken in half. Not 100%, but we're almost done. So that's pretty cool, ain't it? Isn't that wonderful? Okay. Yeah. Oof. I don't like these guys at all. I don't trust how much damage they can actually deal. They can wheel and deal. They're Gavlon, man. I don't think I've gotten the magic increase yet, and it's really depressing. So all these guys do is they open up shortcuts in this area, this temple. But, like I said, it's the very last key in the game. It's understandable that they'd have, like, a bunch of shortcuts that you can suddenly unlock in the game. But hey, wait a minute. There's more items, isn't there? You bet your ass. 
Okay. These guys are really goofy and they can sometimes not hit you, but I don't want to trust the wall being badly coated. I love that noise, too. It's fucking cool. Uh-huh. Come here, big boy. Dunked! And they have so much gold, too. I don't know why they gave them so much gold. Oh, that's right. We gotta actually do this. Oh, hang on. Let's do... Let's put Dragon Pot away. We don't need that. It's one less thing I gotta go down. Blammo! Feather Boots! These are the best boots in the game. They have the best stats, and allegedly they're supposed to let you go over certain obstacles, but they do not work that way in here. So, blam! Blam, blam! All right. Uh, we're not done yet. There's still more. There's always more in Kingsfield. Every day is a wonderful day at Fred Meyer. I, uh, there's this guy that I swear to God, he only works morning shifts when I go in and I drop my roommate off. Um, and he has, like, the worst, like, it's almost comically negative. Like, he's older, and he's just doesn't like me and he doesn't talk to me hardly ever which is fair most people probably get brain damage talking to me but fuck dude uh verdite okay 700 big ones all right let's use that magic increased can i please have what i want god damn it all right there's also one more ring we need to pick up which is the twin dragon ring if you're like, twin dragon ring, is it? Yeah, it's supposed to be Seath and Gyra. I know my Kingsfield lore. Don't act like I don't know it. I do. All right, so there's a couple of things we can do here. We can do all the shortcuts. We can take the shortcuts! <laughs> and open up all the goodies that we couldn't open up earlier. But why would you do that? That's silly. What are you, stupid? Okay. I don't know why this is... Am I losing my mind? Is there an item in here? No, this just goes around... Okay, yeah, that's where, that takes you to the stone sword, or dragon sword. I don't care about that guy. He's not my problem. Okay, this is a hub. I'm pretty sure. This is like the end hub. Oh, fuck! I didn't mean to go in here! Your eternal sleep begins now! Oh, fuck. This guy has one hit. Yeah, hard boss, right? But weren't you paying attention to the lore? That's the real dark magician. Yeah, he's, he's a big bony bastard. And he can kill me in exactly one hit, so I should probably be smart. I do not want him to get a hit off on me. He will actually kill me in one hit. This is not a joke. I'm not exaggerating. He'll also infinitely respawn those golems, too. That's his, like, fucking magic power. He's not dead. This is the second to last boss in the game. Were you expecting something a bit more epic? Well, you and me both, right? <sighs> He dies like a sack of shit. That's right. You're fucking dead. I thought that was the secret area. Never mind. Oh, what did he drop? Did he not drop it? <laughs> You're probably like, Seth, is it really worth it? And you, you know what my answer is? Is yes. It doesn't matter what you think. It's absolutely worth it. This. I don't remember what this is. I think it's the... What is it? Oh, it's Verdite. Okay. So, magic increased. That's not what I wanted, but it's fine. I'm... So that sh shit takes you to the fucking bone zone. There's one more item I want to get before we leave, because I'm pretty sure it's Twin Dragon Ring. Twin Dragon Wing. Uh, let's be smart. You might be like, oh no, you're running really low on your fruit. Don't worry. I'm not worried about it. You shouldn't be worried about it either. 
But saving the game is nice. I'm not going to complain about that. Oh, maybe you don't. You get the... No, you get the twin dragon ring in the... No. We'll, we'll talk about it when we get there. Uh... Oh, I want the save spot. That's what I want. I want to save my game. Let me save this intensity. Okay. So, I'll actually include the beginning area of the final dungeon and getting the greatsword repaired. Because it's actually kind of important. But... This actually, that's right, this area unlocks the, uh, the portal room. I'm dumb. Don't listen to me. I don't know anything about this game. This game is a, this game is a mystery to me. I just played it today. I've never, never played it before. So, this is my first time. We got a first time around here! <laughs> I don't know why that made me laugh either. It just did. Don't, don't be a hater. Okay. So this is a huge, huge important part, okay? This is like the end of the game, right? That portal will take me and shake me and break me, okay? This is it. Don't fuck around, we're not done yet. These guys will kill me in like a second. Music's so fucking intense. I'm only killing these enemies because they will stay here if I don't. Okay. We're at full health? Good. So this is where we officially do the thing. This is what I've been waiting for the whole game. Put those goddamn herbs away. Make sure this is ready. Alright? You think I'm joking? I'm not. Green dragon rod? It doesn't work here. Just sprint. Just fucking sprint. Don't stop moving. You will die as soon as you let go of this button. As I stop moving. You thought I was joking, I bet, right? You're like, oh, fucker, they don't do that much damage. Yeah. I didn't make that up. Okay, take that Verdite. Don't die. Come on. Whew. Fucking made it. God damn. Okay. Save. That shit can't get in here. I'm all right. We're going to have to come back here. There's an illusory wall next to me. What's this? With all the power left in us, we remove all the seals and restore light to the sword. Please use the power to close the door of darkness. Use both sword and magic. Do not forget. Bum, 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 bum. Take the moonlight great sword? You bet your ass. All right. Give me that. Give me that. Look at that shit. Look at those stats. All right. Now, what's this? It's Seath. Way before Dark Souls. He kind of let himself go even back then. So this special is this. Okay, that's not the special. That's not the special either. There. That is the special for this. Talk to her again. Hey. Since ancient days, this graveyard was hidden, has hidden ornaments, each beyond a sealed door. Now the seals are dissolved. Surely their contents will serve you well. Talk to her again. Everything depends on you. Power of the sword and power of magic. Please, you must not fail. Now, the dragon seals are opened. Verdite? Double verdite. I thought it was twin dragon ring. Oh well. Eat those things. I have three magic increased. Magic increased. 
magic increased. Magic learned! It's fucking firewall! Oh. Oh. It auto-tracks and fucks enemies. It is so good in this game. Firewall is the best. It doesn't ever not be the best in any game. Okay, so let's let's stop fucking around. We gotta get we gotta get real. So let's get out of the dungeon first. Oh Jesus Christ. Just go where I'm going, I know what I'm doing. That's the important thing. Don't wanna go that way. Oh my god. No. All right, we're safe. We're good. We're good. We're great. We're wonderful. All right. Well, we're not out of the clear just yet. We'll eat this later. Promises. Also, these enemies respawn, so it's pointless killing them. And also, there's death pits. <gasps> Get the fuck out of this hellhole. Okay. So. Alright. Let's do the smartest thing we can do. Phantom Rod? Phantom Rod? Phantom Rod? Oh wait, I'm already there. Phantom Rod? Phantom Rod? I don't know why I keep calling it, that's not what it actually is. Alright. I'm going to call it there, and I'll see you in the final one. See you then.